Hola, en esta lección vamos a hablar acerca de las palabras y, o, y ni. In this video, we're going to be talking about the affirmative words e, and, and o, or, and the negative terms ni for nor or not even and ni, ni for neither nor. Here are some affirmative questions with o. Juan tiene un hermano o una hermana. ¿Te gusta el fútbol o el básquetbol? ¿Conocen la comida española o la colombiana? ¿Se baña Pepe en la mañana, en la tarde o en la noche? ¿Fue usted al parque o al restaurante? ¿Vas a la piscina o a la playa? Now, we'll go ahead and answer them in the affirmative using e for and, or using the negative using ni or ni. Juan tiene un hermano o una hermana. Los dos. Tiene un hermano y una hermana. No tiene ni un hermano ni una hermana. Notice here we have a triple negative. Literally, he doesn't have neither a brother nor a sister. ¿Te gusta el fútbol o el básquetbol? Los dos. Me gusta el fútbol y el básquetbol. No me gusta ni el fútbol ni el básquetbol. Again, we have a triple negative. Literally, I don't like neither soccer nor basketball. ¿Conocen la comida española o la colombiana? Las dos. Conocemos la española y la colombiana. No conocemos ni la comida española ni la colombiana. And again, we have a triple negative here. Literally, we aren't familiar neither with Spanish food nor with Colombian food. ¿Se baña Pepe en la mañana, en la tarde o en la noche? Las tres. Pepe se baña en la mañana, en la tarde y en la noche. Ninguna de las tres. No se baña ni en la mañana, ni en la tarde, ni en la noche. Woof. It's like a quadruple negative here. Literally, none of the three. He doesn't take a bath, neither in the morning, nor in the afternoon, nor in the evening. ¿Fue usted al parque o al restaurante? Los dos. Fui al parque primero y después fui al restaurante. No fui a ninguno. No fui ni al parque ni al restaurante. Literally, I didn't go to neither. I didn't go to neither the park nor to the restaurant. ¿Vas a la piscina o a la playa? Las dos. Voy a la piscina y a la playa. No voy a ninguna. No voy ni a la piscina ni a la playa. And again, we have a triple negative. I'm not going to neither. I'm not going neither to the pool nor to the restaurant. So in short, O means or, E means and, and ni means nor, not even, while ni, ni would be like neither nor. The basic formula for using ni or ni ni is that if it goes before the verb, it makes the sentence negative. But if it goes after the verb, we will still need a no before the verb, because in Spanish we like to use double negatives, triple negatives, however many negatives we can in a sentence. And there are also some expressions you might find with ni. One would be ni hablar, which would be like saying no way. Or one of my favorites is ni idea, which is like saying no idea. Muy bien. That's all for this video going over e, o, and ni. Let me know if you have any questions or comments about this video, and feel free to practice your own sentences with e, o, and ni in the comments section below. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for updates on new video lessons, and if this video was helpful, you might want to check out the other videos in this series. If you want to practice e, o, and ni, click on this video. If you wanted to see how we use the other affirmative and negative expressions, click on any of these different videos. Or if you're ready for the test over all the affirmative and negative expressions in this series, click on this video. Gracias por mirar y nos vemos.